Well, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. Good morning. <laughs> Hope you're all doing great. Hope you had a good weekend, and welcome to a new video on Gala. Um, wanted to do a bit of a wanted to do a bit of a video. I mean, the markets overall today started relatively positive. Uh, who knows if that's going to be sustainable? I don't. Um, but uh, but but no, we started positive. We saw quite a lot of bullish momentum for gaming coins this morning. Uh, it rotated into meme coins, um, so it's uh, it, it's still we still see the the rotations going on. Uh, but we also saw some momentum for Gala, and if you look at the daily time frame, and that's also one of the reasons why I wanted to cover it. There's multiple reasons why, but all right. Uh, you can see that right now we're we're in in some sort of a consolidation here between five cents ultimately, and then. Uh, I would say four cents, potentially a bit lower technically, uh, but we're consolidating here, and that in combination with a relatively bullish market and some momentum under gaming coins, I think is interesting. All right, I think there's potential. Also historically, um, which is also interesting, even though uh, it's a, it's a, it's not too great, I think. Uh, but historically, Gala and Jasmine actually were quite correlated. All right, so if you, for example, look at this move, I believe the, the, the time that uh, Gala got this move, Jasmine also got its first bullish move. Now, uh, that's positive and, and not positive because Jasmine has already rallied a lot, all right, and Gala hasn't. So maybe that correlation is gone. Maybe it's lagging behind. That would be positive. Maybe it's gone entirely. That would be bearish. But all right, so, so right now, if you look at Gala, look, you do need to wait for a bullish breakout here, all right? I, I don't necessarily see any reason why we would break out... Uh, and that you should enter prematurely. What you see is that we got some nice positions opened here, uh, all long orders, so that's great. Um, but I think the markets right now and this move is is too is too young to actually assume that it's going to be anything. All right. Ultimately, what we're waiting for, I think at least, is a real breakout above five cents. So we first need to break above some sort of a level right here at four point seven cents, which we haven't done yet. And then we need to, then maybe you can enter, all right? If we break above 4.7 cents, uh, then, then we'll be consolidating here. And then from this consolidation, you could maybe build up a position uh, to front run a breakout above 5 cents with a continuation uh, higher. But all of this, look, I, I think Gala is, is, is interesting because historically it's been quite bullish. Um, it's, it, it's got some great market makers. And technically, I do think that there's some sort of a bullish element to this consolidation. But I also want to be very, very clear that this is nothing yet. All right, we still have two major levels to break above. If you look at the momentum here, sure, it's 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 great, but it's still relatively low compared to, to where it was. And we have seen some bigger moves in the past. Um, there's also no major spot buying coming in. So I'm making this video relatively, relatively early. I think it's more likely now that we'll stay in this consolidation. And then at some point of time, as long as the markets stay relatively bullish as well, at some point of time, we'll start to talk about breaking that five cents area. Uh, and then if we break five cents, then, then sky's the limit, all right? Or at least sky's the limit. Then, then we can actually rally up quite a bit, up to six cents, 6.5, potentially seven cents. Um, so that's where the potential is. But for now, like I said, I, I think it's a bit more likely to expect some consolidation. Um, we got some nice positions open, so a breakout above 4.7 cents, I do think is likely, but to break above 5 cents, we either need much more bullish momentum for Gala itself or some sort of a very strong gaming narrative, which we have had, um, but it, it, it hasn't affected Gala that much. So those are my thoughts. That's what I think you need to know for now. If you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments. For now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.